All right, this tutorial is going to show you how to use the Create 2D Sketch button, and it's going to show you how to uh, select your first plane so that you can begin a sketch. So let's go ahead and click on Create 2D Sketch. Notice this is actually a two-part button. We don't ever really want to change to the 3D Sketch, not for this purpose anyway. So make sure it says Create 2D Sketch, and then click the top half of that button. When you do, um, you're going to see uh, that your mouse is dragging along a little banner that says select a plane to create sketch or an existing sketch to edit. So we're going to go ahead and choose one of these planes. Now, let me, let me uh, kind of explain how you select the plane. First off, if you're wanting to draw an object in the front view, you need to select a plane that goes along with that particular view. In this case, look at how the front surface is facing here this plane is facing the same way. Now it's also good to know how to name these planes. For example, if we look at our axes that are, that are going through the center here, uh, we have the y-axis, the x-axis, and we have the z-axis. Um, and both the positive and negative directions are shown here. Um, if you're confused about which one is which, uh, simply look down here at the drawing indicator, the 3D indicator, and it shows you the positive directions of all three axes. So we have the X, Y, and Z. Those are the positive directions, the direction that the arrow is facing. So in this case, this front plane that we have right here, since it's, it's going in the direction of the X value and the Y value, this would be the X, Y plane. Um, another example here, this plane right here, if you notice this goes, goes along with the same direction that the top view is facing. So if we wanted to draw on the top of an object, we could simply choose this plane. And if we look again at our 3D indicator, we notice that that's also the direction of the uh, X, Z axes. Um, so this would be the X, Z plane. Um, in this case, let's go ahead and just click on our X, Y plane. And notice that when we do that, it automatically takes us to the front view and we're ready to begin a sketch.